What makes for a great climate tech company? I can imagine that's a question on your minds and it might be difficult to answer with all those companies out there. So let me explain to you how we look at how good a climate tech company is. Basically, we look at four things. First of all, it's about the size of the greenhouse gas problem that this company is solving. Think about concrete, it's 5% of global emissions. It's a big problem to solve. And compare that to, the, for example, plastic bags, create a lot of waste, very small GHG problem. Secondly, we care about the depth of the impact. So is this technology reducing the carbon footprint by 10%? It's something, but it's not great. Or is it producing by 90 or 100%? And it's a ladder that we get excited about and we think will still be relevant in 2050. Third of all, we think about the systemic impacts because we're not trying to solve a small thing. We're trying to solve the entire economy. And especially when it comes to scarce resources like lithium or biomass, we want to make sure that it's used where it's needed most. And finally, we look at the broader impacts because even though we're trying to solve for greenhouse gas emissions, we don't want to create any other problems along the way. So we look at the broader social and environmental impact. These are questions on our mind and we write about them. I write about them in our monthly newsletter. So if you're interested, you can sign up below.